to? Three of us are in our room when someone knocks on the door. Yo, Urchin! That's probably one of her brothers. Virginia looks at the door, then looks at me. And that's Donald with a cream pie. I'm so not opening it. Fine, I'll are get it. Are you sure? It's lemon cream. Yes? Yes. That yes, was it's pie. <laughs> hey, Rain. Is my sister in? There. <laughs> I, I didn't even see that part pop up yet. <laughs> it's fine. Maybe you're on a slight delay, too. Well, I'm, I'm a, I am on a delay because of the fraps thing and, and yeah. the sweet chair, but it's just like, I, I make up some of this stuff and it pops up anyway. Yeah. Yeah, she's here. What's up? Well, you see, I have this pie here. <laughs> Logan's doing this thing, and he's asked me to, me and me Luke, and, yeah. to uh, to look, round up people for it. It's um, kind of weird. <laughs> what sort of thing? He's got an idea of how people can make money. He's going to run a bingo game, so the more people join, the more you can win. Bingo? Nah, I guess that's more like bingo. Bingo! That's right. And are you in? It's five bucks to enter. I'm not playing any game you're running. Not her. I'm not running it. Logan is. Yeah, he's like, it's not my fault if you lose your money. <laughs> Save it. Because this can get you lots of money. You want me to risk it? I'm yes, trying to stay out of back. trouble now, though, and I'm like, Donald is trouble. But he's not running it. That's true. I say save it, and if something goes wrong, like money lost and or merits lost, just reload. I just hope it doesn't take a long time to come to pass. I'm not sure that's an improvement, see? That's what I'm saying, save now. Fine, no money for you then, right? Save game. See, it's only five bucks, so I might play. I'm just wondering if I'll get into trouble somehow. I'm not, like, I'm not sure how that like, would Like, I don't know this is trouble. against school rules or something, because maybe it's gambling. Yeah, I, I see your point, but... It would have it been stopped by now, because he's running around and asking all kinds of people. We'll do it, but I'd rather not. So, let's see what happens. Sure, I'll play. Great! Head over to Falcon Hall. I'll be in there in a few. All right, so that's happening today. Good. Mm -hmm. I don't have to wait to see how this goes. I might just lose five bucks, which sucks, but I might still reload over it, even though it's not a big hit. Shortly after, well, because I'd reload just because I'd be like, I don't want to play bingo. Um, <laughs> shortly after arriving in Falcon Hall, I see a familiar shock of blue hair. Familiar, you know that guy we saw twice. Did he even have a voice? Yeah, you voiced him. What was you his voice? You gave him the, the braces voice. Oh, that. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Luke. Uh, sorry. Logan. Wait. I thought that was Luke. I don't know. I, I don't know. His only response is, is to my smile, to my slip, is to smile and toss his head. His hair fluffing out recently. Maybe they're twins. Uh, Show. Have you come to play my game? Whatever, we'll give him that voice too, yeah. He's the dungeon master. Oh, I guess so. There's not a lot of ways to earn extra money around here. I thought he was the wild player. Huh? No, he's the wild player. Oh, okay. Was there something in particular you were interested in purchasing? I don't know why. Oh, no reason. Just curious to see if I could help. Huh. I don't this guy's totally a con, man. Yeah, I don't know. Going. No, I'm fine. Well then, pay the kitty. I want to be like, what kitty? Oh, <laughs> for my five dollars. How's this going to work? Anyone pays a little, bit, then someone's lucky takes the jackpot. Simple. That's kind of what I thought it would be like. Yeah. If maybe not just the person who won, but I pretty much figured someone's gonna lose their money. Some people are gonna make some money. The fact that he wanted to sell us something tells me that there is a winning sheet. Maybe. So you pay ten bucks and you win all the money. Are you playing? No. If I won, someone might think there was, that would be a... Uh, bleh. <laughs> Sorry, the, the braces stick sometimes. <laughs> if I won, someone might think that bleh, that was less than fair. I'm calling the numbers. I'll show you when we have more people here. 
Within a few minutes, Luke, Donald, Jacob, and about five others are gathered in the hallway. Logan brings out a large board game style box, opens it up, and begins distributing bingo cards. The rest of the box is filled with a pile of flat cardboard circles and a strange plastic device that rattles when he picks it up. 100% mechanical and campus legal. I checked. Take a handful of covers. You'll need them. Is everyone paid up? Money's counted out into the empty box top on Luke's, ah, on Luke's lap since he's not playing either. I pick up some bits of cardboard ready to cover my, cover my squares if their numbers are called. Logan rotates the top half of the plastic device. It makes a clattering sound as it turns, and then a black disc slides out of a hole and into his hands. He holds it up. N41. Calls number after number, and the patterns grow across our cards. Dot dot dot. Of course, in the end, it's not me who yells bingo and collects all the money. That was a quick way to lose five dollars. Um, is that it? This... This does seem to be a problem with the winner-takes-all approach. Something different next time, maybe. There is a next time. Yeah, maybe it's like, uh... Maybe it's like you kind of get roped into stuff like that and you can make money, but then you end up hanging around with, like, Donald and his, and his cronies. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Yeah. Anyway. Plus, we just lost five bucks, man. Come on. Yeah. Don't like, play. it may pay off in the end if you were interested in either of those. Yeah, but I'm not hanging around with Donald money. this time. Like, Yeah, man. Ellen's where it's at. Yeah, like, we're not going to get to hang around with Ellen or, like, Damien I mean, or anybody. Especially Ellen, because her voice is just so dreamy. The only real benefit to hanging around with Donald is we meet people we haven't met before. But Pretty much, but that's because it's a whole different clique. I want to meet that vampire girl again. I want to see what her deal is. But yeah, I have she, a feeling... She's like, she wants to have a skeletal zombie army thing. But I have a feeling she's kind of like Suki, and they're probably just kind of like minor, minor, minor background characters you don't really interact with at all. Probably. No thanks. I forgot his voice all of a sudden. <laughs> Alright! You know, like... Alright! I'll keep voice, yeah. looking! I'm still hitting puberty! Yeah, I, I couldn't do it. <laughs> I think my voice is too deep. I, maybe if I tried, I could make it squeak. I just, I can't think of how to do it with my voice right now. I'd have to, like, screw around. Oh, you finally succeeded at studying. You're not a retard. Yeah. Well, it's or, as some out. people say, a retard. I'm just gonna try to not let her stress get too far over 30 from now on, because that seems to be when we fail at everything. Okay. I report to the room on schedule for my, oh, exam. Crap. Oh. <laughs> We go. We must reach the exit safely. Jesus. Is there another one like this? No, I think this is the one with the monster. What monster? Yeah, we spoiled it slightly. What? I don't know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, but be warned, you are not alone. Oh, goody. Damien clones, kill them like the rest. Well. Uh, Breeze or... Would this detect the monster, you think? Might. Might? Might. What else we got? Far speak. Impressions. Attack charm. Begins to heal up the soul cards all the yeah, awareness just revealed some of the map to us. Yeah, it's not enough. Well, I'm gonna use Breeze first to see which way we should go. West. Alright. We are facing west, so... Scared, Tim. <laughs> ah! There's a hodag in this room. How do you know what that is? I I don't know. Actually, that's a good question. Um, kill it Give with up. something. Kill it with something. 
Uh. Wait, 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 wait. What what all do we have? Did we have something that was useful? Cause this thing looks tough. Um. Maybe we can teleport them away. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Wouldn't get him very far away from us. But as long as he's out of our path, we're fine. To a nearby location. Teleport. Teleport. Teleport them. the wall. Oh, dang. <laughs> Alright. That gives us some, some breathing room. Yeah. Ha ha ha! See ya, sucker! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And do we have no. to do that again? Not again. Oh, man. Well, this next time we get to cheat and know which way to go, though. But we have a bit of a head start, so. West. Yeah, that that takes a turn. Yeah, I know. So now he's closer. Shit. You got free duty anyway. He's not behind us yet. I'm kind of like, I don't want to turn around and see him, Tim. Oh. I don't think it's south. West. Yeah. It's... Oh, there it is. Oh, it's thank over. God. That, <laughs> All right. That wasn't as hard as we thought it was going to be. No, but I was like, I don't want to get eaten by a monster. <laughs> um, uh, be gone with you. I don't know. Something about, like, because that's not a new thing. Like, you know, a lot of older games had that kind of, like, looking down the tunnel thing. Yeah. I always felt like those were so claustrophobic. And so, like, when you do walk forward and find monsters, it's like, ah! <laughs> At least for me, anyway. Because I'd be like, Jesus Christ, it wasn't there a second ago. Because, you know, you don't see it in the distance. It's just yeah. all of a sudden it's in front of you. Booga, booga, booga. But I kind of like that. It's like, oh, a blue monster. Womp, he's behind us. <laughs> <laughs> Run away! Um... <laughs> Like, move, you're in my way. Congratulations, Ray. For succeeding in your quest, you receive five, you five merits. Hell yeah. Oh. And another five merits for achieving your goal without violence. Sweet. Excellent. We're finally back under 20. Oh. Excellent. Thanks. Can I have 15 more? <laughs> Yeah, why don't you give us I ten? Hope you, I <laughs> hope you enjoyed putting your skills to practice. It's like, how about you give us ten? How about you lose five more? <laughs> okay, okay. How about you <laughs> shut up? <laughs> yeah. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have another student to look after. It'd be funny if she was blushing with that face, because it'd be like, I have another student to look after. <laughs> Mr. Grabner. <laughs> <laughs> he's not a student. Oh, he's my student. Oh, <laughs> uh, gross. Um, <laughs> I guess I could go relax now. <laughs> I wouldn't want to date a woman whose nose kept falling off. Ellen gets up early on Saturday morning and returns after the mail and allowances are delivered. What should I do today? Study. Yeah, study. Always. Ah. So this time only my green magic went up nope. instead of my smarts. It is better than nothing, but damn. Oh well. I guess we can't always monopolize mini. Today is the first sports club meeting of the spring semester. We're playing soccer, but with a twist. Magics. You can now move the ball by kicking... Ah, you, you can now move the ball. That is what... Uh, never before done in soccer, ever, Tim. Uh, you can move the ball by kicking with your foot, or you can push it with your mind, since it's an easy spell that almost everyone can do. Only single sharp pushes allowed, no controlling the ball for the upperclassmen. But if you use magic, you need line of sight on the ball, and you have to hold still while casting. That means... If people who don't have the ball run around wildly enough, they can disrupt anyone trying to move the ball by magic makes the game more frantic and paranoid because you have to watch everybody, not just the people near the ball. Yeah, seriously, that'd be crazy. That's one heck of a handicap. Yeah. Because I like, I could see somebody not even chasing the ball, just like pushing it out of bounds and stuff. 
It's also a power increase for the goalie, <laughs> seriously, who can easily stand still for a moment to change the ball's direction even from halfway across the room, if it's not guarded well. Getting past that into the net is no easy task. Everyone seems to be having a good time, except Kyo. He's still playing the game, he just doesn't look happy about it. I think he was in character. Yeah, but he didn't talk. When we finish for the day, he skulks off before I can ask him what the matter is. Way! That was great, wasn't it? It's good to be back. So you're not upset anymore? About the sports and magic thing? Yeah, it's all good. Cool. 